Earth, we know it spins once a day. Yes, thank you. So, so you spin, you know, when you spin pizza dough, it kind of flattens out. Yeah. It gets wider in the middle. And So, Earth, throughout its life, even when it formed, it was spinning. And it got a little wider at the equator than it does at the poles. So, it's not actually a sphere. It's, an, it's oblate. And officially, it's an oblate spheroid. That's what we call it. But not only that, it's slightly wider below the equator than above the equator. A little chubbier. A little chubbier. Yeah. Chubby is a good way. It's like pear-shaped. Yeah. So it turns out the pear-shapedness is bigger than the height of Mount Everest above sea level. If you were on top of this mountain in Ecuador, how much higher than the Mount Everest would you be? There's a 20,000-foot mountain in Ecuador, which is right, Ecuador is like near the equator. Hence, Ecuador. Oh, uh, you're, you're, you're just not giving up. <laughs> and uh, that mountain is actually, the summit of that mountain is one and a third miles higher away from Earth's center than the summit of Mount Everest. Okay, question number two. But, but wait, wait, but you got to know, let me just so you understand. We've been fed this misrepresentation of our own planet on the belief that, in fact, we have real surface features. But cosmically speaking, we're practically a perfect sphere. 